Joining Koretsu is not just about writing a check to be a member and looking at a couple of occasional deals every year. We're looking for people who want to be very active and involved in both the chapter and in the investment process, in our due diligence process. So we are, I tell people all the time, you need to be a shirt sleeves, hands on, in your face investor that's willing to get involved and participate in due diligence and, and participate in that mind share that we're famous for so that we create the best possible deal flow for all of our members to benefit from. I believe that the Caretsu Forum provides a great opportunity for women who are interested in investing in early stage companies. I believe that the mind share is valuable and I also believe that the due diligence um, is a great part of the investing process in early stage companies and because of the rigor and the breadth that the Caretsu Forum due diligence reports provide, um, it takes away some of that risk. Women are generally more risk averse in their investments than men and so having the opportunity to interact with other angel investors, hear their perspective and their viewpoint on a particular investment, learn from them in terms of their areas of expertise as well as um, to read the due diligence reports um, is a great opportunity for us to um, feel more comfortable with the opportunities and take away a lot of the risk. Um. Unlike almost all the other angel groups in the area, we are not early seed stage investors. We, we focus on A and B round investments. And so people often ask, at what point is the company ready to come and present and pitch to Koretsu? And I, I tell entrepreneurs all the time that I believe that with the exception of life sciences companies, which typically have a long protracted period to get through FDA approval, the perfect inflection point for us is the company that is absolutely ready or who has just transitioned from R&D into sales and marketing.